Hey guys, um, Jurassic Horse here. Um, I just took a break for a week, basically. But we're back, and we're finally back from our Fallout 3. So yeah, I kind of forgot what we were even doing. I think we're going to minefield or something to get get her ass kicked by some mines or something like that. So yeah, let's get going. What my weapon is. Okay, so we got one for stim pack, two with the gun, three is laser. That, 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 that. Okay, cool. This gun is cool for now. Oh yeah, and um, think straight flan, straight S T R eight F L O. Or zero and uh, I don't know how to spell it. I don't even know how to say it. Whatever. He wants me to be evil, so I'll say. Okay, I'll be evil. It'll be interesting. Cause evil is hard to be because it makes you feel like a douchebag. It's kind of the whole point of even being evil, but okay. Jeez, I keep pressing the M button to bring up my map. <laughs> I'm so used to playing while. Well. Okay. Back in the Fallout mode. Presentation of these badly graphics rocks. Not badly. Well, crap! Is this spider? It's an ant. Didn't even see it there. And no, that. Can't press B to get my bag. I was like, what? No, I want that. I'm not playing around. Shoot the ants in the antenna. It can frenzy them, but shooting the ants in the looks good too. Usually he has buddies. And before we go there to minefield like we're supposed to, I need to stop by Super Duper Mart because I forgot to get some stuff. <sighs> go, communist poster. Yeah. <laughs> so we got the loading screen. Mysterious stranger visits. Oh god. Those are the things when you're just sitting there and out of nowhere. When you're just sitting there and out of nowhere, and like a mysterious stranger pop up, like when you want to bat and shoot something, a mysterious stranger will pop up and will just shoot it for you, and he might accidentally kill you or something, because his shot, like, I don't know, kills everyone in one hand. It is really weird. And then he goes back into underground somehow, I don't know. Um, this is really weird. <laughs> to worry about any children yet. What gives me a thing so when I'm talking to kids they get like a better stuff. Like that girl that walks around in Megaton like Billy Cruel has like a stash full of ammo and if you have this perk you can like use it or like um you can like ask her where the thing is and like she'll tell you and like she'll give you the key or something. Scoundrel. That's good for now. Makes it easier for me to barter. Increasing my speech and barter. Nice. Being a scoundrel makes people like me. I think I killed everyone in here. I'm just missing ammo. I was watching over the horrible last session that they had, session 3. And they, uh, with no audio, I was watching it and I forgot. I was like, why am I not picking up this ammo? Completely forgot to pick up the ammo, but I picked it up now. Laser ammo. Cool. This music is kick okay. Um, where are we going? And up there. Mine is. So we're doing minefield now. I still have to go do the Arafu thing with the family. But you guys don't know what that is yet, so it doesn't matter. That's a 
That's a tail for another day. Another part of the session. You're listening to the adventures of me, Herbert Daring yes. Dashwood, and my stalwart ghoul manservant Argyle. Today's episode, Escape from Paradise Falls. So little faith, boss. I could disarm this slaver junk with my eyes closed. One second. There, now for yours. Stand still. Argyle, you magnificent bastard! You did it! Don't thank me yet, boss. We still need to get out of here. Let's go, while the guard's away from the front gate. Not so fast, my flesh-rotten friend. That girl we came in with, we're the only chance she's got. Come on! Uh, always with the dames. All right, she's locked in there. They call it the box. First, we need to remove that guard. Allow me. Hey, fella, got a light. Uh. Lotus, kick! Yay! Haha! <laughs> now the door! Child Bunch of raiders boss. over there. Okay, lady, you're rescued. Now let's get out of... What? Boss, it's empty! Hands up, chumps. Nobody escapes from Paradise Falls. Oh, well, this explosion could be part of the radio. We we'll luckily having like a little mini war before. over there. Drop the steel, you slaver scumbag. You boys alright? I busted out of that box and was almost home free. I noticed your ticket. Wait a minute. We do rescuing around here, sister. Now, now, Argyle. No need to be hasty. We owe this young lady our thanks, miss. <laughs> Everything sneaks up behind me. I need to get more awareness. Or... Jesus. I'm in WoW mode, then I'm in KOTOR mode. Whatever you think. I need to get the animal friend for ASAP. Cause all these random attacks are pissing me off. And a little radio show you to listen to. When I was watching the Scorch 82 walkthrough of this game, um, he was playing as a good guy. Um, I was, he was like in a park fighting a whole bunch of raiders over here or something like that, and he was listening to this show on the radio. And I was like, I wasn't even paying attention to him or anything, I was just listening to the radio. It was awesome. That show was so cool. Oh god, I'm my beast man seven today. Keep forgetting I don't have to go in bats every single time. No. Don't want your meat. <sighs> I said meat. Okay. Alright, there's someone over here. Ah, uh, that guy. Lasted a bit way too long for being shot by an assault rifle. I mean, that's not how long there's muscle to live when you're shot by something. Like oh! Damn. Ow! Ah! Jeez. Did the bullets get soft and like destroyed during the war? I mean, really. It wasn't an RPG, but getting shot by an assault rifle will sure kill you no matter what. What is the sniper? Oh! Fudge. I don't have too many bullets for this thing either. Ah! Got him. That's what you get. Reload all my crap. I'm all here. Let me see that sword that I got. Officer sword, eight damage. Awesome. I'm gonna make you my melee weapon. 